Hold up. Yes, I want to make a complaint. His tenant, the pimp, was the first person to deliberately put dings in my car. I mean, I even took photographs. I was parked all the way on the other end in a visitor spot. And he decided he would park in Glynis's spot. And that's where I first got a, a big dent in, uh, I think it was my back door on the passing, um, no, it was the driver's side. But um, I'll never forget Nelson saying to me, oh, you got a big dent there. And I just, just, I mean, you can't prove it, so there's no wasting the police time on stuff like this, but just these peedly things on top of more serious things where they actually will find me money that will accumulate because um, they just they just keep doing it. They've been trying to drive me out of here in this place that is basically, you know, one of the main drug hubs of the Hudson Valley. You know, this drug train that runs from the Bronx all the way up to Poughkeepsie. All the river towns are, you know, involved. And everybody knows it. And, um... Get the fuck away from my shit! Get the fuck away from my shit! It took months for my morning glories to grow, and I had to take them off the patio, put them in the kitchen. What are you talking about? Don't you ever talk Man, check your bitch. What are you talking about? Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. Ladies, damn, it's hard. I was so rude. Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. What are you talking about? Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. Ladies, damn, it's hard. I was so rude. Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. Yes, I will make some people. I'm fucking like wrong. What? Ladies, damn, it's hard. I'm so rude. I'm so rude. What? What? What are you talking about? No, I'm fucking like wrong. What? Ladies, damn, it's hard. I'm so rude. You sleep with your dog, like. Oh my god. Ladies, damn, it's hard. I'm so rude. You sleep with your dog, like. Morning. Get the fuck away from my door before I call the cops. I've been recording you all morning. Calling. Get the fuck away. You can't call the cops for shit. You're not nobody. Who are you? I've been recording you. I've been recording you. I need to make sure they show you who you have to see. See the type of information you can't You know, like they ain't playing to me or other pictures that she has. You know what I mean? Saying if don't shoot, we got first floor modeling, first floor photography. You know we got F double M, fast money movement. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do. Okay, you got you got you work on the arm or the internet? Or you work with the team, so I can do it Alright, he gave me he gave me my number, man. What 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 are you talking about? Can I ask you a question? If that bothered you, if that was a problem, no, I'm not wrong. What? Really? How you are? Police department. Oh. Okay, we're trying to be. So let's just like shake your booty and just like. Uh. Oh. Really? How you are? He's a board member. He's elected by the people who live here. The board told us to run a red letter. We run a letter. That's four times in one month. You call them one. And then don't come out and say that. You called on me. I ain't even do nothing. Why would I try to? Why would I try to scare you? What? Why would I try to scare you? You can't scare me. Why would I try to? Because you're an ignorant bitch. That's why. Now I told you before. Don't fucking talk to me. Thank you. I hear you threatening me, which forces me to listen. Fuck up, bitch. Come out your door right now. And what's gonna happen? Right now. And what I, I didn't even do nothing. They not they rang on my door, but I was like, he said, come here. My, my daughter's what's name the deal with right y'all in the parking lot? Lies that damage someone's reputation. And 
And what are you saying that they're harassing you doing? What are they doing? Are you, yeah. you sleep with your dog. Like she needs to be in another house. Yeah, I know. And I'm gonna talk to her face is crazy. This woman, that woman that just spoke right there. <sighs> and I'll tell her to her face she's crazy. I had done nothing to this woman. Nothing. I googled her name, discovered she was charged with manslaughter of the death of her own baby. Brutal beating death, 1987. I hear this woman say, I'll punch her down the stairs. I had no idea why she would say such a thing, so I asked her why. And she called the police on me. I did nothing. Nothing. For three years, we got along fine. The reason why I called police, yeah. and I said she might call police. Yes, yeah. I called police. Yeah. I called police. I can't ask you if I heard wrong. No, no. I can't? No. So you want me to worry? I don't care. So you want no. me to worry? I said, what's pussy. And I don't know how to do this. Man, we're talking about tonight. What, what, what did, uh, what, and so he didn't say anything else? What I said was, you want to get the police involved. And if he's walking yep. up the stairs, he said, the police won't help. Yep. You. And I've recorded them. About hurting you. What did my dog do, Dolores? You find out, my sister. Well, well, let me know so that I don't have a problem. My white sister. Fuck that white bitch up, Nadia. And I don't. What you say? Me, and Carol. I need to do. What you about the all, bitch? What you say about me and the all? What did I say about you and what? I like all. You can't fucking spell, but tell me what you say. Uneducated bitch. You in a special ed class? You tell these people that you was a special ed when you was in high school? Motherfucker. And I know when you went to school. Could you remember my sister? Your little special ed case? I know when you fucking went to school. I ain't never talking about, about your steak ass. But I know who you are. Poor ass bitch. You couldn't even go to school, but you put your ass out. I told you, don't you play with me, because I don't mess with none of these. But when you start fucking with me, acting like you don't lost your mind, I'm going to help you get your mind back. Because I know how to bring it to memory, okay? Good night, I'm going to bed. Now, if you hear me, I'm going to tear a fucking head off your brain, okay? I'm going to let you know. Because I try my best, and I tell anybody. I said, I will whip you. That's what I said. Okay. That's what I said. I'm sorry, that's why. I said, I don't want to miss you. That's on YouTube. That's on YouTube. With what? With the knife? Yeah. With the knife? With the knife that you found in the hallway. With, with the bread knife? Take something and hit my door. Let me call the cops. I said, I will whip your. That's what I said. Okay. I'm sorry, that's why. I said, I don't want to miss you. That's on YouTube. That's on YouTube. With what? With the knife? Yeah. With the knife? Yeah. With the knife that you found in the hallway. With, with the bread knife? Take something and hit my door. Let me call the cops. Can you leave it now? Asking a simple question. No, because you. Because I'm trying to solve no, the situation where you, you acted are. like you wanted to fix it, and then you just called me a stupid whore. Because you are. Uh, uh, I am. You are. I'm okay, a whore. Okay, all right. No, you're not a whore. You're oh, crazy. Okay. You're crazy. Oh, okay, that's you're better. Crazy. You're that's crazy. better. Do you realize you cost me work? You How cost did me I my cost life. You work? Yeah. Yeah. I would pay a million dollars for a clip 
of Bikram's voice saying, Why everybody called the police on you? But today I walk down the stairs and I see our new neighbor apparently molested a seven-year-old. But you can't always believe everything you read, so I'm not going to drag this guy into it. However, since Robin is really, you know, she's the wife of the board of directors, I couldn't, and responsible for all of this mess for ten years now, I couldn't resist resist a quiet, sarcastic, you know, little jab comment as she walked behind me down the stairs um, earlier this evening. And um, I couldn't believe... What she said to a group of children playing downstairs. Stay away from her. Don't go near her. I cannot believe she just said that. You don't like her? How do you set the record straight? I used I to do that. Shut too. up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do whore. That too. Stay away from her. Don't go near. Hey, talk to me. I'm Because it's not worth wasting talk to my me, life I'm listening. any more than you've already tell, stolen I have, from me. Tell me how I took your life away. Tell me how. I'm the one that's singled out and and uh, and have been in compliance. I'm totally doing what I'm supposed to do. But rules are broken, and was wondering why I'm the one that just gets targeted, and everyone else seems to just not worry about parking stickers or leaving their friends cars in their spots indefinitely, you know, and and uh, I'm the only one that gets singled out. She op opened her door and came out. I heard her. She went back in. Then she came out again and just stood there. It's really that complicated. Wait, how can you, how can you see me staring? How can you see me staring when you're not even looking at me? And to violently threaten me forced me to first, one, pay attention, make sure it was safe for me to walk out my door. I had to look out my windows to see if he was here. And by paying attention, that turned into paying more attention because there were prostitutes coming and going every single day. Drug deliveries. But that was uh, people downstairs, but they were still riding together. And all this stuff is going on, which is fine. I still know enough to mind my own business. However... The board of this complex was always giving me a hard time about where I parked, where I walked my dog. Imagine trying to explain to the police how over 15 years this man, the former councilman no less, the management company who, it might have been 17 years, but almost 20 years, who retired a couple years ago, but then got himself back on the, the board of directors. Imagine trying to explain to the police how it is that he'll tell his tenants to park in such a way to aggravate me. His tenant, the pimp, was just evicted last Monday and barely a week has gone by and already they're sending me letters warning me about fines for videotaping and um, this after I recorded him talking about turning his place into a halfway house to get a message to me. Correct. That's <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
of the few times that I ever called, the last time I ever tried to contact Lou or VIP offices were was um, 2006, maybe 2007, uh, possibly 2005. But the idea that Ray would say, is she keep calling you? I don't, I don't call that guy. VIP Lou Bataille. Power. Failure. Thursday, 2.04 p.m. Yeah, hi, this is Noel. Yeah. Hey Noel, this is Raina. Hi. Um, just a quick question. Mm -hmm. Um uh you remember I said um something about just leaving the car for ten minutes or so, or even an hour or whatever, uh, in the shade and, and you agree that's probably not a big deal. Right. That is what you do. I don't know about that. Yeah, yet. I guess what we're talking about. I looked at your door, and it was a mess, and the board said repaint that door. The, oh, so the, there was a field trip apparently that day at the board meeting. They all came down to look at my door. Oh, I doubt that. I, I doubt it, too. The only thing is she was afraid that you might harm her, then you could. Because she knows you'll never have her. No, but you know what she do now? She'll go like this. And I'm coming up to her, she'll go, yeah. If I'm outside, she coming, she go around the back. So that was in two weeks. No, that's now. That's now. The other day, I got. Make a mess? Oh, it was a mess. Well, in your obviously like non-cultured opinion, because you could barely notice. My what opinion? Uncultured opinion. Thank you. You have been told it's a civil matter. Okay, they don't make the fines. People who run this complex make the fines. Okay, they are responsible for fining and not fining people. If they find that you're in violation, you get fined. If you have a problem with that, you take it up in small claims court with the building, not individual people who live in here. Okay, that's where you're wrong. Now, if you take it and file a claim against the Crest Park management, he wasn't on the management. They, they just had nothing to do with management. He's a board member. He's elected by okay. the people who live here. Uh, I filed a, f a form on Friday, which is why they're doing this. I don't care. I can tell. Power failure. Thursday, 11.57 a.m. VIP Louboutin. All right. That's not concerned me. I so only, you're I'm, I'm only that? here. Are you giving that back to me? I'm only okay. here to deal with the complaint. I really don't care about your lawsuit, their lawsuit, whoever's lawsuit. It's not my concern. I don't deal with civil stuff. I deal with criminal stuff. And you're borderline criminal. I'm okay? Borderline Which is why we're telling you to leave right. them alone. If they bug you... I haven't seen them in a week. If they bug you, pull out your camera on your phone and record stuff. That way you have evidence. I've told them the same thing. And as far as my mom, uh, Lou writes, um... 
that she's parked in a visitor spot two two more times, either in defiance, and these are the only two choices, either in defiance or because she thinks she can continue to do it. But the board has told me to tell her if she continues, she'll be fine again. Da 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 da. Um, and uh, that's what I'm talking about. It, it's like it can't be that I left my car in the shade because I was trying to cool it off from further deterioration. It's like it's either because I'm in defiance or that I just think I can continue to do it or you know whatever. So my question is, um, you know, what, if you were me, what would you do? In light of that letter, I'd park in your marked spot. Yeah, that's what I've been doing all along. My point is, I'm the one that's singled out and and uh, and have been in compliance. I'm totally doing what I'm supposed to do, but I just want to understand why I am um, the target. Because, I mean, it's kind of obvious. You're not a target. The board told us to run a, write a letter, we wrote a letter. All right, all right, I'll try one more time. My dashboard's melting off, and you tell me not to say that because I sound like I whine. They don't want to hear things like that. So, um, but that's the reality. I have a practical reason for leaving my car in the shade for 15 minutes, and I can't do that without being fined. I think at this point, it should be pretty obvious that it's easier to just park in the numbered parking spot. Because you say you're being harassed mentally and all this stuff, just park in the parking spot. I'm sorry, once again, that's what I have been doing. So why am I continuing to get aggressive, um, vindictive, mean, um, singled out letters from VIP? You know, what's, you know what's, what is it about me that your father wants to bully me? He doesn't. He gets told by the board what to say. So you didn't mention to him that, you know, she just might park in the shade for a little bit to cool off because her dashboard's melting. Why is that so unreasonable? I guess that's what my question is. Because it's against the rules. We sent you a copy of the rules that said single cars are to park in the numbered parking spots. And for months I've mentioned that all these other rules are broken and was wondering why I'm the one that just gets targeted and everyone else seems to just not worry about parking stickers or leaving their friends' cars in their spots indefinitely, you know, and and uh, I'm the only one that gets singled out. Um, so, uh, yeah, again, we're talking in circles. Um, and because you are convinced that you're being singled out. And um, I am being singled out. And I keep telling you that the IP sends the letters to whom the board tells it to. That's all there is to it. They tell us to write a letter, we write a letter. We get a response, that goes to the board. The board says, this is what so we're doing. So I'm really, so it has been reported to me. Those are your father's words. It has been reported to me. Sure. So, so this person who is just like me, just a resident here, uh, that's the language you use, or, or is it more of an official witness reporting back? I mean, it sounds like police jargon. Well, if we said somebody told us, that's not really professional at all. But it has been reported, like as if I'm being spied on. I mean, that is what it looks like. I don't think that's the case at all. It has been reported is just the word that you use. Okay, um, we didn't get a letter on official letterhead from somebody claiming to be from the CIA that said they saw your car in a non-numbered spot. Well, you seem to be pretty convinced that everybody's picking on you, and I don't live up there, so I don't know what it's... Well, actually, I was just repeating myself over and over again because I thought you seem like a nice woman, and I am. I don't see how you can't see what I see from my point of view. People do it all the time. If I was a relative or a close friend, you might have it in you to say, it is kind of messed up, but I don't um, say that. I'm at work, and thus, I'm a representative of VIP, and we represent the board of Hillcrest. So, so the board has had time to, to have an emergency meeting on this in the past, uh, you know, they've had two meetings this month, apparently, because this letter is after that meeting, and um, or, or enough time has passed that it's just obvious that this is something that wasn't discussed with the board. There wasn't the time to do that. 
they communicate via email on a daily basis. And and where and if I leave my car in the shade for 15 minutes, that see, my, that's my point. That should alarm everybody. And if you all think it's a big joke, then I, that you know, it's like well, this will really put her over the edge. That's what this is. That's why I'm documenting every detail of this entire quote unquote issue. I'm I'm actually being an anthropologist, not a, a crazy conspiracy theory person. Because I believe last time we spoke you hung up on me. Because you started screaming at me. Screaming? <laughs> really? You mean these neighbors that have been harassing me since two thousand six? They're saying and you when you treat and i said he's got traffic prostitutes and you go out of me. your way to tell that him nothing to that do I recorded me. him. Yes, because you have no business recording, recording prostitutes. I didn't call <laughs> <laughs> See, that's why I record all this, right? Yeah. Because when you play it together, it just, I mean, it's not that interesting. Believe me, I'm not that in denial. But, it, I mean, you know, lies, lies, lies. I was telling you that people were pretty abusive. Um, when you started yelling at me, you were screaming. yelling at you. Yeah, you were. Um, I just actually transferred the recording to a tape a few days ago, and it was a very, it was much shorter than I remember. Well, it seems to me that you are much more willing to keep me on the phone and anybody else in for the four minutes. Who will listen to you for as long as you deem fit to talk in circles? Is that how it seems? <laughs> Exactly. Why haven't you contacted the police more recently? If you had, they're harassing you all the time. Why are you leaving notes outside the door? Why aren't you calling the police the way an adult would? Mm -hmm. Social, 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 social. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Okay, I sent officers up. They couldn't locate that vehicle. What, what exactly are they doing that's suspicious? He's there with his trunk open and one of the prostitutes is in the building somewhere. I don't know, but are you kidding? I, the, the vehicle's registered to a Hillcrest address. I'm not saying that it's going to be. You know what? I tried. Whatever. She opened her door and came out. I heard her. She went back in. Then she came out again and just stood there. It's really that complicated. Wait, how can you how can you see me staring? How can you see me staring when you're not even looking at me? The board told us to run a red light and we run a letter. <coughs> you're not a target. The board told us to run a red light and we run a letter. I might knock the shit out of that might yes, be that's the problem. It's not illegal. It's not illegal. It's not illegal in jail. Yeah. But they know it's gonna be because of her. It's not illegal. And what are you saying that they're harassing you doing? What are they doing? Who broke the- Sitting still, don't pay the bills. This car net is coming, cut your lights off. I know how I feel, which don't feel good. The lock, Mark. Do them. Who broke the lock? Did you break it? You're Kyle Edison, aren't you? No, I'm Because you knocked no, on my door and said Kyle that, isn't that what you said? Aren't you Con Edison? So you broke I the lock. I said Mark, Con Edison's You're the here. same woman oh, I got on camera know? last night, going all the way to the other building, sneaking around. Are you, yeah. You sleep with your dog. Like, I come home, I go in my home, I leave, I go to work, I do nothing. I used I, to do that Shut too. up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do whore. That too. I have done nothing to you. Somebody's gonna come out and clap, and I'm gonna get this shit on camera. I need another officer at the front door to help out. You need another? Why would you fuck that, man? Fuck y'all police, nigga. Y'all can suck hard back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, police ass. So what, man? Don't you go nowhere, cause she oh, ain't everybody yeah. cause of you. If we see, if she see me and say, she she me all of a sudden she's a talk crazy cause we talking about her and you are on YouTube. Can we, I asked the policeman. I asked the policeman. He said, no, 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 no
I don't know. I guess I have to say it's not illegal. Yeah. 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 Ye
Yeah? I don't need it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> hey. I'll put it in. She about two, she won't come the next day. But if she catch your ass lying, which is why I'm obsessed with recording this, recording that, because oh, you lie. That's what it was. That's your name did come up. I'm sorry. Uh, ask me who you were. I said, that, that was the day I called them. They said, oh, the lady that takes pictures of everything. <laughs> they, they knew exactly who you were. And just like you said, I asked Ray again. I said, how many times did Eddie, Eddie break, Eddie, uh, little Eddie break the door? He said, six times, and that's why your building doesn't have it. You keep insisting it's because somebody kicked my door in. You insisted. Ask Ray he why we don't have a, a buzzer. He didn't insist every time I... She's psycho. Who did that? She's yeah. psycho. What did you say? He's going to hit I'm not going to say nothing. We're going to watch. I know that he's dangerous. Yeah, we'll see, because I'm recording everything. I'll stay on the phone I'm with you. I'm recording everything. I got my neighbors' as proof. Let's see. Let's see, because you're crazy. We all know, so let's just see. Once the cops get here, they're like, oh, it's her again? So I asked Pam McNair to come. There are eight apartments in this building, five of which, until just recently, housed violent felons in each one. The pimp was a self-proclaimed four-time felon uh, with his daily prostitution traffic, which included heroin and or crack and heroin, crack for sure. And then there were, you know, they'd yell about getting needles stuck in their arms and stuff. And um, you have the woman who killed her baby across the hall from him. Uh, Robin is next to both of them. Downstairs, you've got the registered nurse who would sell crack and I believe heroin, but I'm not sure. And um, the guy who sold guns, also Pam's son, in the back. And across the hall from him, there was uh, a bunch of guys that were up to serious no good. But um, I would hear their conversations in the hall, which were extremely alarming. But there's just too much to talk about. The, this particular picture was of a prostitute whose name I don't think I ever knew. I never saw her before, I think. And there was a prostitute named Lisa who came here this night who said to a guy in my stairway, hallway, um, outside my door, I could hear them, and I recorded the, her saying that she was going to steal her Coke money. She said, don't worry, I know what I'm doing. I'm going to steal her Coke money. And the guy, from what I gathered, they were between places, and he was kind of like lurking around, waiting for her to finish, with, you know, I guess getting the money, whatever, and um, so he was lingering around out in the hallway, and um, and I'll never forget, it was about an hour and a half later, I, the ambulance is coming, taking this woman away unconscious, and uh, Daniel's out in the hallway saying, oh, thank you, thank you, officer. You know, thank you for your service. It was so revolting. And the bulls can see the stuff from their side window. Um, this was definitely, they had to have seen this going on. And yet uh, it would go, stuff like this was going on all the time. And yet they were really tight friends with the pimp. So, I mean, I imagine her teaching her little elementary school kids, and maybe that's too young to do the whole D.A.R.E. program thing, but just this hypocrisy, you know, of a teacher working in a school, and you hear about all these, you know, 80 to 100 heroin overdoses just in a couple years in Westchester, and then, and then y you've got her calling the police on me. She claims she was talking to the district attorney, I mean, literally, like, days, weeks maybe before I recorded this from the other side of my door, 
I'd gotten along fine with these people. I mean, we didn't really like each other, but we were cordial and polite. Um, her daughter was pulling Glynis's clothes out of the dryer and said, are these yours? Like she was caught. And I said, no, but Glynis left him in there, so she probably won't be mad, whatever. And, and I said to her, look, you know, I'm sorry about this fighting going on because she was young. And I was so nice to her, and she just gave me this fake smile. And then she's, they all, they all just backstab you. <laughs> then why would you go in there? Then why would you go in there and tell him? I was talking to a neighbor. She has your conversations in your home up on YouTube with lies underneath it. Call saying that you um, hire prostitutes. This is he threatened to put a hammer in my saying, head. That has nothing to do with me. And you. That's the way you treat And I said he's got traffic prostitutes. That has nothing to do with me. And you go out of me. your way to tell that him to that I recorded him. Yes, because you have no business recording, recording prostitutes. She has your conversations in your home about YouTube with lies on don't say nothing to none of my kids. I'm warning you. Videotape that. That's a warning. That's a That's not real? That's not real. Oh, is that what's going on? So I'll keep praying for you. And to violently threaten me forced me to first, one, pay attention, make sure it was safe for me to walk out my door. I had to look out my windows to see if he was here. And by paying attention, that turned into paying more attention because there were prostitutes coming and going every single day. Drug deliveries. But that was uh, people downstairs, but they were still riding together, and all this stuff is going on, which is fine. I still know enough to mind my own business. However, the board of this complex was always giving me a hard time about where I parked, where I walked to the dog. Dolores. When did that happen? When did that happen, Dolores? I'm going to get you. So don't ask Carol. Don't ask Pam. Don't ask nobody. Know that Dolores the one that did it. Did what? I'm just that crazy because I know what I do. What are you going to do? Girl, let me let, me let you know what I'm going to do. Your dog. But now come nowhere near me when I'm in the hallway. Ever. All my children. Because you would know. What did my dog do, Dolores? You are finding out, my sister. Well, well, let me know so that I don't have a problem. My white sister. And I don't, what you say? Me and Carol, I need to do, what you about the all, man? What you say about me and the all? What did I say about you and what? The, I like all. You can't fucking spell, but tell me what you say. Uneducated bitch. I used I, to do that shut too. Shut up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do that too. Stay away from her. Don't go near her. Okay, talk to me. I'm listening. Because it's not worth wasting talk my me, life any more than you've already Can stolen I from me. They keep calling us. They're the ones calling. Whatever's going on, they're the ones calling. I'm asking you're, a simple question. No, because you. Because I'm trying been, to solve no, the situation where you, you acted like you wanted to fix it, and then you just called me a stupid whore. Because you are. Uh, 
Uh, I am? You are. I'm okay, a whore. All right. No, you're not a whore. You're oh, crazy. Okay. You're crazy. Oh, okay, that's you're better. Crazy. He's a board member. He's elected by okay. the people who live here. The board told us to run a red letter. Red letter. But well, you need well, help. Honey. Well, get help. There are doctors that will give you medication that will help you. Get what will they help me do, Robin? Not get beat up by the prostitute or have a hammer well, put in my head? I don't head? know anything about you getting beat up because I've never seen or heard anything of that. Oh. Are you doing laundry? It's too late. So am I in the way? Yeah. I guess I know what this conversation is about. You? Get the fuck away from my door before I call the cops. I've been recording you all morning. Calling. Get the fuck away from my shit. 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 You in a special ed class? You tell these people that you in a special ed and you was in high school? Motherfucker. And I know when you went to school. Cause you remember my sister, your little special ed case? I know when you're fucking with the school. I ain't never talking about, about your steak ass. But I know who you are. Poor ass bitch. You couldn't even go to school, man. Put your ass out. I'm asking you're, a simple question. No, because you. Because I'm trying to solve no, the situation where you, you acted are. like you wanted to fix it, and then you just called me a stupid whore. Because you are. Uh, uh, I am? You are. I'm okay, a whore. Okay, all right. No, you're not a whore. You're oh, crazy. Okay. You're crazy. Oh, okay, that's you're better. Crazy. You're that's crazy. better. Do you realize you cost me work? You How cost me I my cost life. You work? I would pay a million dollars for a clip of Bikram's voice saying, why everybody called the police on you? But today I walk down the stairs and I see our new neighbor apparently molested a seven-year-old. But you can't always believe everything you read, so I'm not going to drag this guy into it. However, since Robin is really, you know, she's the wife of the board of directors, I couldn't, and responsible for all of this mess for 10 years now, I couldn't resist resist a quiet, sarcastic, you know, little jab comment as she walked behind me down the stairs um, earlier this evening. And, um... I couldn't believe what she said to a group of children playing downstairs. Stay away from her. Don't go near her. I cannot believe she just said that. You don't like her? How do you set the record straight? If you're ha they're harassing you all the time, why are you leaving notes outside the door? Why aren't you calling the police the way an adult would? You're the person being overly stressed out. Okay? So let it, let it go. Oh, I'm a, I want her to piss on herself when, I, when she yes, sees me from the Did you see Frozen? Let it go. Let it go. Alright? I'm going. And speaking of letting it go, I'm going. Okay? Call me November 30th and tell me how it works out. Alright. Don't say hi to Everybody. We we you know what? You done pushed me to the brink to it. You made me come out of my character, honey. But remember when Willowbrook was open? If I said you needed, they'd come and straight jack you and do a survey on your ass. She's crazy. Yeah. But yeah, she needs to be in another house. Yeah. I know. And I told her to her face. She's crazy. Even the cop that came to the door said, she needs to be put away. She needs to yeah. be Yeah. Yeah, she does. Yeah. I'm like, I don't even, but you know what? If no. she was there, I'm there. Because she'd up there and said to me, now, oh, I, I heard you out here rapping and giggling. When somebody so sorry. Said, I know. Don't even so worry sorry. about it. It's my fault. No, it's my fault. She's crazy. No. No, Bobby, that's your fault. Let me tell you something. It's my man told me that she was crazy. I was playing yeah. with you when I said that. Yeah. No, my landlord told me she, she, she was crazy. Right? 
Everybody she knows she's crazy. Up, she she crazy. Why? No, I'm, I'm, I'm stopping your spin. No, 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 go. I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, go ahead. because you don't shut up long enough to let anybody talk. I just want to remind you, I have everything on tape, so it's but less you editing. you have nothing on tape. Less That's editing. For just an apology. No, you have nothing. Ahead. You have nothing on tape. And I am never going to apologize to you because there is nothing for me to apologize for. I don't need your apology. How I've did it start? I've never done anything How to did you. it start? Shut the fuck up and let me finish talking and I'll tell you. Okay. You put a note under my door. <laughs> So I asked Pam McNair to come. Alright, we need another officer to the front door to help out. We need another. Why would you fuck that, man? Fuck y'all police, nigga. Y'all can suck call back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, police ass. Right, right. So what? I mean, it's like it's like living in a a relaxed prison atmosphere or something like. So this is lovely. That's right, a fish stick featuring the likeness of Jesus. I've been recording you all morning. Calm. Get the fuck away from my shit. No, 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 please. 
fucking don't read. Are you kidding me? Thanks a lot. And you like that? I, you like that? That he just leaves because he's your friend? You're so crazy. You st I'm crazy? You're because nuts. you parked over my fucking line oh, after three Regina. years of your abuse. And you're making this worse. You tell me the Department of Corrections is coming here I never to gang you. rape me? I, I recorded it, you anything. fuck! I recorded it! Well, then, that's illegal, isn't it? No, sweetheart, it's not! And you're gonna be sued, you stupid old man! Oh my god! Oh my god! Uh, that's, this is why you get into the, maybe you'll start recording things too if you ever find yourself in my position being bullied, targeted, and beaten up by people that have obviously nothing better to do. As real estate agents are showing, um, from prospective family a uh, place, but it's just, it's just funny how this place is just so, um, uh, questionable in many, many, many respects. And any time I ever try to offer uh, my services in any way, my time to just help out in some way, I, I mean, as far back as I offered to do a website for the place. And the next oh. day, and the next day I get letters about, like, my dog. And I have to spend four months fighting with you about a dog. Do you ever have a dog? Do you ever bond with a dog? I saw the charming website you had up. That was nice. I don't know which one you saw, but I have about 200 websites. Okay, I saw the one with Donna Johnson on it, which I'm sure she would love to know about. Who's Donna Johnson? Donna Johnson. 8A, I believe. There were Donna people, Johnson? There were some people in one of the buildings who you felt were ganging up on you. Donna Johnson? Might not have been Donna Johnson. Might have been somebody else. And I saw the charming picture of my father that you had on your website. Did you see the picture of your father and how he takes a vote at the board meetings and how nobody says anything but he, like, sort of just whips his mallet out and decides this is how it's going to be? Oh, yeah, he's a tyrant, all right. Are we finished? Because every time I... End of messages. Well, it seems to me that you are much more willing to keep me on the phone and anybody else in For the four minutes? Who will listen to you for as long as you deem fit to talk in circles. Is that how it seems? Well, it seems to me that you are much more willing to keep me on the phone and anybody else in For the four minutes? Who will listen to you for as long as you deem fit to talk in circles. Is that how it seems? He's a board member. He's elected by the people who live here. The board told us to run a red letter. We wrote a letter. He's a board member. He's elected by the people who live here. The board told us to run a red letter. We wrote a letter. He's a board member. The board told us to run a red letter. We wrote a letter. He's a board member. The board told us to run a red letter. We wrote a letter. He's a board member. We're here investigating a complaint. This woman is in tears. <laughs> I'd like to thank all the people that have made this possible for me. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> I used I, to do that shut too. Shut up and let me talk, you I crazy whore. I used to do that too. Tears. I have done nothing to you. Okay, okay. We need to talk to you. Yes, tears, yeah. I was told on... I was told on... Good night. Can I just tell you one quick thing? No, I'm not Can I tell you one thing? No. Can I have that? That's my garbage. Well, it was out and what does it what does it say? Is there a name on it? It says it says it says dear dear students of Christ the King. Listen, you admitted that you wrote it. It was the central piece of your complaint that you're leaving notes around. It's bothering the woman. Okay, there's other allegations made, but but this is the only thing that we could tangible. You know what I mean? Exactly. Why haven't you contacted the police? Oh, I'm yeah. recording everything. I got my neighbors' as proof. Let's see. Let's see, because you're crazy. We all know. So let's just see. Once the cops get here, they're like, oh, it's her again? <laughs> they're like, we've yeah, been, I, we've I been know. four different times for four different people. We just couldn't honor everybody. Oh, that's yeah. Now you're yeah. dealing with me. So I asked Pam McNair to come. Everybody knows what you're about. Exactly. Why haven't you contacted the police? The police take care of everybody with the Wait, what did she say? The police have been told to What did they say? You mean these neighbors that have been harassing me since 2006? They're saying you 
Uh, how is that? This, this, this is how I'm harassing you? See, this is why I want to do this inside. Now you're getting loud. I have no secret. You're, you're dangerously close. Which is why I wanted to do this in some home to stop that. And you have to realize that we're investigating at right. the point. Okay. We have neighbors. Yeah. Do you want to take this inside now or do you want to end up speaking too loud again? And um, Pisco police don't intimidate anybody, let alone their own citizens. I'm sticking up for them. Um, you know, the people that think they were intimidated, let them come here and, and tell it. I'd like to hear from them. But that's just not true. Oh, damn, I've never seen you so quiet. <laughs> You Pam, I know that you should not. I know that you like the letter. You shouldn't have wrote the letter, bitch. If you don't, you should mind your own business. Come next, doesn't tell me. Come next, doesn't tell me. You should mind your own business. Come next, doesn't tell me. Cause you know what? You know I'm gonna get you. Morning. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck away from my door. Before I call the cops. Get the fuck out of here. 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 Oh, we gotta help because I've been, I've been recording you all fucking morning, so go ahead and do what you gotta do. Call. Get the fuck away from my oh, door. Let's call him. Simple as that. Why? Why? Did you call the cops? I don't give a fuck. You can't call the cops for shit. Because you a crazy <laughs> bitch. Get the fuck away from my door. Simple as that. There ain't shit to talk about. Get the fuck away from my door, you crazy bitch. He said, I will kill her. I will kill her. I'm listening to you, and I want you to listen to me for one minute. I know, but the end of that was he said it would kill me. So that was the whole point. This is what you should do in your life. For what you should pick November first. When November first comes around, you should take your phone and leave it on the kitchen table and turn it off. That would be like you going to work without your gun. Listen to me. And for one month as an experiment, you should not make a single recording. You should not go on YouTube and post videos. You should do nothing for one month, for 30 days or 31 days, for one month. And when you go out, you see your neighbors, you should ignore them. Don't talk to them. Or if you talk to them, just say hello. Nothing more. Don't complain about them. Don't do anything for one month. And see, see what happens in that one month. See what, see what would happen. Because you know what? I bet things would start getting better. And okay. you know what? This guy brings prostitutes to the house every day. Like, is it affecting you? How does it affect you? Are the prostitutes, are they committing crimes against you? Probably not. Okay? All the things that you have problems with, where people park, where the firemen park, all these things, ignore them for 30 days. Where the firemen park? What are you talking about? One of your videos I watched a couple of years ago was about when the firemen were up there uh, for a fire call, and you started asking them, why do they have to park in these spaces and block these spaces? That's not what it was. You misunderstood I'm, I'm that. Not sh I, I don't care. It doesn't matter. But it does. But sh it doesn't matter. No, I, I just brought that. You made this happen. We just couldn't honor everybody. About to start shooting at these men. That's what I would do. 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 The FBI, now part of the investigation, the county hopes will put a dent in heroin traffic north of the city. New at 6 tonight, CBS 2's Lou Young reports from Peace For everything you said about everybody, let me be the one to get you. I got my neighbors' proof. Let's see. You know. Turn around and back out of the apartment. Back out the door. Back they got the, the fucking squall, my nigga. Pop that nigga. They got the squall, nigga. They about to start shooting at these niggas. That's what I would do. Objection, this is all hearsay, Your Honor. No, no, uh, I recorded it by accident. I just got a new phone and I didn't know how to turn it off. This young man trying to make himself, make a way out of the hood. Goes back to it, so you know, I mean, we can't have it both ways. Hey, bitch, I've been recording you the whole time. Simple as that. Do what the fuck you gotta do. He got his new modeling agency, aka Pimpa. You need help. I do? You do, and I'll pray for you. I keep praying for you. You're gonna pray for me? You. You're gonna pray for me? Please. I do. How about you just get the whores out of the building? Because I don't know what you're talking about because you need help. Oh, well, okay. It's a delusional world that you live in, and I can't help you with that. But well, sweetheart, you see, that's bad. why I take pictures of this delusional world. Okay, and when your pictures prove something of reality, because they don't. Oh, okay. 
cause ever. And I've recorded anything. them. It's about hurting you. You are lying, fucking and you're bitch. A and I'm gonna fuck you. Don't, up. Don't, yeah, put, don't, put the stick down. Don't, bitch. I will shove that don't. that thing so far down your motherfucking throat. <laughs> so people they left the hood they never want to come back and when people go to the hood they get killed we can't have no ways tell them jay hey we gotta tell protect jay. our own we gotta protect our own real nigga shit and i know our situation is set up i come from the same place y'all come from so i know how hard it is i know how hard it is we gotta take responsibility for the shit we doing you understand what I'm saying? You understand what I'm saying? We set up and put the condition that we're not. The statistics are against us. Let's not make it hard on ourselves. Let's not make it hard on ourselves. Okay. Yeah, 
assault rape um, um, of two female minors uh, by five minors were reported and uh, after a three-month investigation all six juveniles were arrested this was one of the two prostitutes that I saw in Dollar Tree that morning with their faces smashed in more black and blue than this photograph it's the only one I could find that was like it
And then I said that I couldn't do it by myself. <laughs> right. right. And I asked Jenny. And then I, uh, then I found friend. I had. We just couldn't honor everybody. Now you're dealing with me. So I asked Pam McNair to come. Everybody knows what you're about. Let's see, because you're crazy. We all know, so let's just see. Once the cops get here, they're like, oh, it's her again? <laughs> they're like, we've been, I, I we've been here four different times for four different people. Everybody knows what you're about. Don't say nothing to none of my kids. I'm warning you. Videotape that. That's a warning. That's a warning. You can't both talk at the same time. People can't watch it on TV. Just call me. I'm just trying to do it. I'll keep praying for you. Just okay, so when we when we all go inside and see the prostitute coming out, um, you can. Be the one to get you. Okay. No, I'm, I'm, I'm stopping your spin. No, no, no. Go. I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, go ahead. because you don't shut up long enough to let anybody talk. I just want to remind you, I have everything on tape, so it's but less you editing. Have nothing on tape. Less. Okay. I don't need you to come closer because I don't trust you. You're crazy. Really? Please. It's time. P A W H. Oh, Thanks. shut up. <coughs> oh, uh, let me finish. <laughs> Mr. Mayor, I know you're tired. You had a long day, but let me finish. All right, George. Okay. Come on. Okay. Thanks. Okay. All right. Um, All right. Thank you. Good night, night, George. Have a good night. Uh, before we close, uh, somebody. Oh, we have another. Oh, God. Please. This is the mayor threatening to arrest me. I don't even understand. I don't even understand. Whatever anyone wants to say. But the, anyway, the point is, I simply asked the mayor uh, in response to watching him laugh at me. I had read in the newspapers that he was charged with uh, some sort of felony for election rigging, something like that. <laughs> If you want to go online and post okay. stuff, that's called cyberbullying. Oh my god. Now you are being the bully because now you're posting stuff derogatory about somebody that you're having a bully. Like I said. What did I say about you and what? I write all. You can't fucking spell, but tell me what you say. Uneducated bitch. You in a special ed class. You tell these people that you was a special ed when you was in high school? Motherfucker. And I know when you went to school. Because you went with my sister, your little special ed case. I know when you fucking went to school. I ain't never talking about, about your steak ass. But I know who you are. Gorgeous ass bitch. You couldn't even go to school, but you put your ass out. You're That's crazy. better. Do you realize you cost me work? You how cost did me I my cost life. You work? How did I affect your work? You're not going to own this conversation. No, how did I affect your work? I'm recording you. I'm recording you. What are you talking about? Her son breaks into my electrical closet. They do nothing about it. Right, just like 15 years ago when you stole my bike break. And they call the police the on me. Like, when I politely ask his mom, you know, the kids were here. I almost broke my neck riding down. My mom down could do whatever the, the fuck hell. she wanted to do. Yeah, she I know. could do whatever she wanted to do. And she What's calls the like, oh, she. Because you don't snitch, but you call the police on innocent people you steal from. First and foremost, he broke my mom don't live by that code. My mom don't live by that code, you heard? The fuck you my computer. Man. 15 years I live with this. This started over two years ago when this man threatened to put a hammer in my head. And I started paying attention. Wait, don't move, don't move. I know that woman. Which one? The woman with the green top. That's harassment.
They're bullying me. They're harassing me. Again, uh, it's unfounded. All right. I record it, and you can call us just as easily as they did, right? If you're getting harassed. Even the cop that came to the door said, she needs to be put away. She needs to be Yeah. Yeah. Then why would you go in there? Then why would you go in there and tell him? I was talking to a neighbor. She has your conversations in your home up on YouTube with lies underneath it. Call saying that you um, hire prostitutes. This is he threatened to put a hammer in my here. head. That has nothing to do with me. And you. And I said he's got traffic prostitutes. And do you go out of me. your way to tell that him to that I recorded me. him. Yes, because you have no business recording, recording prostitutes. She has your conversations in your home about YouTube with lies underneath it. Call saying that you um, hire prostitutes. Don't say nothing to none of my kids. I'm warning you. Videotape that. That's a warning. That's a That's not real? That's not real. Oh, is that what's going on? So I'll keep praying for you. Don't say nothing to none of my kids. I'm warning you. Videotape that. That's a warning. That's a Oh, okay. But you well, need well, help. Honey, well, get help. There are doctors that will give you medication that will help you. Because we're going to uh, bestow some honors on some uh, well known citizens. You're not nobody. Who are you? I'm recording you. You're not. I'm recording you. Okay. And, you know what? This guy plays Foster Fields to the house every day. Every day. Every day. Every day. I'm indoors, but I see you standing in the doorway. If you have so much to say, come say it to me as a woman. I didn't I tell you I that heard the other you open the door. Did I tell you that the other day? But did I tell you that the other day? I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm gonna beat your ass. She so was on the she Please. talked about everybody in the I know that. You destroyed your life yourself with your own actions. Oh, really? With what you do to people. You created this mess. Hey, so she go out on the You made this happen. You see what you caused? You by, caused. by talking privately you to Robin. Caused it. By talking privately to Robin. She brings it on herself, man. That's all. She brings it on herself. She hey, so brings Dolores, Pam, Glennis doesn't have anything to do with it. You made this happen. You see what you caused? You by, caused by talking privately you to Robin. Caused it. By talking privately to Robin. She brings it on herself, man. That's all. She brings it on herself. I don't, to do. I don't know what to do. They turned on and off my electricity, so my computer got fried. So she's blaming And I came downstairs, and the super told me that he saw kind of trying to figure out what happened, and it looks like he tried to turn on his own electricity. And in doing so, fried someone else's apartment. The, the door is all mangled open, and all That's I did was ask dumb. him. That's how I know you're crazy. crazy. I didn't want to call the police on him. I didn't want to call the police on him. I didn't want to call the police on him. I didn't want to call the police on him. She's psycho. She's psycho. Who did that? She's yeah. psycho. What did you say? He's going to hit I'm not going to say nothing. We're going to watch. I know that he's dangerous. Yeah, we'll see, because I'm recording everything. I'll stay on the phone I'm with you. I'm recording everything. I got my neighbors' as proof. Let's see. Let's see, because you're crazy. We all know, so let's just see. Once the cops get here, they're like, oh, it's her again? <laughs> They're like, no, we've been here four different times for four different people. I, just for I don't even know what you're talking about. We'll see when the cops get here. Yeah. That's all you got to say. I'll wait for them. That's all you know what I'm saying, because you're crazy. Right. I had enough of you, man. I had enough of uh, you. You make them look like crazy. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because when, when did we stop being friends?
When did we ever start being friends? I was never your friend. I'm sorry, when did we stop being civil neighbors? When you turned crazy on me. Oh, really? When you slid a note under my door and then started videotaping everything that I do and started putting slid a note on your door, door, door asking you why all the women in not building are stairs. sitting on the stairs and picking not up what the notes said. Which every second is on video. Prove it because you... I, it's on it. video. No, it's not. Well, if it There's is, too much enough. to deal with because they're not. I have your husband. You made this happen. You see what you caused? You by, caused. by talking privately you to Robin. You caused it. By talking privately to Robin. Her son breaks into my electrical closet. They do nothing about it. Right, just like 15 years ago when you stole my bike brake. And they called the police on me. When I politely ask his mom, you know, the kids were here. I almost broke my neck right down. My mom down could do whatever the, the fuck hell. she wanted to do. Yeah, she I know. could do whatever she wanted to do. And she What's calls the problem? Like, oh, she because you don't snitch, but you call the police on innocent people you steal from. First and foremost, he broke my mom don't live by that code. My mom don't live by that code. You heard the fuck you my computer. About, 15 years I live with this. You destroyed your life yourself with your own actions. Oh, really? With what you do to people. You created this mess. You can't call the cop for shit. You can't call the cop for shit. You can't call the cop for shit. You can't do anything. I can do anything I want. No, I'm, I'm, I'm stopping your spin. No, 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 go. I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, go ahead. because you don't shut up long enough to let anybody talk. I just want to remind you, I have everything on tape, so it's but less you editing. you have nothing on tape. Less <laughs> It doesn't make any sense to me either. I think the translation is, he's just a kid, so it's okay that he steals your bike brakes because you have a car, you don't need your bike, and it's an old raggedy ass bike. First of all, first of all, I wasn't born yesterday. You don't write official letters to schools like a, like a crayon, purple crayon, or black notes, paper, okay? notes to myself that were in my garbage uh, down yourself, here. Whatever. You said you were writing. They go in my garbage, yeah, and you're here so telling you me that I'm borderline you, criminal. You. Listen, and you asked me why I want to, to talk me. about it online? Listen to me. You told me you wrote these. Just call me. I'm going to show you how to do it. No, I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm not saying the guy's innocent. I'm not saying he's not, you know, provoking you at times. What I'm saying is, it's going both ways. Okay? And... One person's back in. So you're the person being overly stressed out. Okay? So let it let it go. Did you see Frozen? Let it go. Let it go. Alright? I'm going. And speaking of letting it go, I'm going. Okay? Call me November 30th and tell me how it works out. Alright. That is what you do. That is the avenues provided to you okay. by your taxpayer dollars. Okay. Okay? Really? Mm -hmm. hey, bitch, I've been recording you the whole time. Simple as that. He's got his new modeling agency, aka Pimpa. You need help. I do? You do. And I'll pray for you. I keep praying for you. You're going to pray for me? You're going to pray for me? Please. I do. How about you just get the whores out of the building? Because I don't know what you're talking about because you need help. Oh, well, okay. It's a delusional world that you live in, and I can't help you with that. But well, sweetheart, you see, that's why I take pictures of this delusional world. Okay, and when your pictures prove something of reality, because they don't. Oh, okay. I might knock the shit out of that, my dear. Yes, that's the problem. I'm going to her ass. It's not going to be illegal. It's illegal in jail. Yeah. But they know it's going to be because of her. It's not illegal. I come home. I go in my home, I leave, I go to work, I do nothing. I used I, to do that shut too. Shut up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do that whore. Too. I have done nothing to you. Somebody's gonna come out clapping, I'm gonna get this shit on camera. Uh, we need another officer to the front door to help out. We need another. Why would you fuck, fuck that, man? Fuck y'all, police, nigga. Y'all can suck hard back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, That's police ass. Right, right. So what, man? But well, you need well, help. Honey. well. Get help. There are doctors that will give you medication that will help you. Get what will they help me do, Robin? 
not get beat up by the prostitute or have a hammer well, put in my head. I don't head. know anything about you getting beat up because I've never seen or heard anything of that. Oh. Are you doing laundry? It's too late. So am I in the way? I guess I know what this conversation is about. You? I know. Hi. Can you put that on YouTube too? Make it easier to call the police now. Why would you call the police? Because I came in here to do my laundry? No, because you're filming me without my permission. Uh, I came in to do my laundry and you're... With a camera? Whispering? Yes, because I'm having a private conversation with somebody that has nothing to do with you. Oh, I thought it did. You said we were talking about you. And if we were, has nothing to do with you? She has your conversations in your home up on YouTube with lies underneath it. Called saying that you um, hire prostitutes, saying that you have something to do with the murder of your ex-girlfriend, hiding the car. Yeah, see, these are the lies. And I used I to do that. Shut up and let me talk, you I used crazy whore. I do that too. Okay. That's my garbage in your hand. It's on the floor. Well, we were told. Uh, is is there a name on there? It doesn't look like garbage. It's all over the place. Like I told you, I'm writing a letter about bullying. All right, well, keep your stuff Because I'm not really sure why this has come to this level where the police are here. Because they feel threatened. Because somebody they made feel a threatened? Call. Somebody made a call. How do they feel threatened by that? They, no, there's general. other things too, other allegations that they're making that none of us have any way to prove what they're making them. And we have like to speak what? to you about like them. What? Don't worry about it. What you need to worry about Don't is worry to about protect. You just told me I was almost going to be arrested. Yes. You told me not to worry about it. You told me I'm, I'm telling you not criminal. to worry about what they have to say. What you need to worry okay. about is what, what you can do to not be in And finally, in tears, she yelled, How, my God, how can they let them do this? She's not it. Because they keep calling us. They're the ones calling. Whatever's going on, they're the ones calling. Well, if you're an adult, we're adults, they're adults. Obviously, there's a problem. Okay? We're here investigating a complaint. This woman is in tears. Okay? Whatever reason, she's saying, you know, X, Y, Z. Okay? We tears. need to talk to you. Yes, tears. Yeah. All right? And we need, we, need to, we need this to stop. Because, frankly, this kind of shit, if you'll excuse my language, it, you know, we're here investigating because we have to, but do you know what I mean? There, there's, there's, there's much more critical things we need to be doing than mediating problems with adults who can't get along. <laughs> I'd like to thank all the people that have made this possible for me. <laughs> Good night. Nothing, and I am never gonna apologize to you because there is nothing for me to apologize for. Well, somebody says, I know. Don't even worry about it. It's my fault. When did, how is this harassing you? Because they keep calling us. They're the ones calling. Whatever's going on, they're the ones calling. Oh. And I am never gonna apologize to you because there is nothing for me to apologize for. I don't need your apology. How I've did never it start? Done anything how did it start? Shut the fuck up and let me finish talking and I'll tell you. Okay. You put a note under my door saying nasty stuff about my friend. So I Which friend? I asked you. God. Which friend? Carol, you know damn well what friend. I, because I talked about Pam and Dolores, exactly. who wanted to break my exactly. door, my and door that down. Has nothing to do with me. Because I referred that to them as welfare do, mothers. That has nothing to and do that with pissed me. them off. Did to you and you or Carol me. showed them that letter, hoping. I didn't show them that letter. He's a board member. He's elected by the okay. people who live here. Uh, I filed a, f a form on Friday, which is why they're doing this. I don't care. I can tell. He's a board member. The board told us to run a red letter, we run a letter. He's a board member. The board told us to run a red letter, we run a letter. He's a board member. We're here investigating a complaint. This woman is in tears. <laughs> I'd like to thank all the people that have made this possible for me. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> I used I to do that shut too. Shut up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do that too. Tears. I have done nothing to you. Okay, we tears. need to talk to you. Yes, tears, yeah. Bye. Bye. I was told Close on... Door. No more. Good night. Okay. I was told on... Good night. No more. No. Good night. 
I was, can I just tell you one quick thing? No, I'm done. Can I tell you one thing? No. Can I have that? That's my garbage. And what does it what does it say? Is there a name on it? It says it says it says dear dear students of Christ the King. Listen, you admitted that you wrote it. It was the central piece of your complaint that you're leaving notes around. It's bothering the woman. Okay, there's other allegations made, but but this is the only thing that we could tangible. You know what I mean? Recorded them. What about hurting you? Because I'll snap. I know. I know. I know. That's what I do. I do. She's a psycho. There is no big as a She crazy and she needs medication. Don't snap. Y'all call in the police. No. She gonna call on the police. Because I'm gonna knock her down. The threat started on Tuesday night as black students gathered underneath the campus's clock tower for a peaceful rally to bring awareness to what they say is racism on college campuses. I think it's really important for us. Like, I can't understand that we are seriously under attack like never before. George, I'm losing, uh, I'm, I'm losing I'm, my audience. I'm almost finished. I'm almost <laughs> finished. Everybody's and clicking off. You know you. what? We're almost finished. I'm that was finished. Everybody's and clicking off. You know you. what? That was That's what I was doing. Polite and kind, however, extremely fake because I was trying so hard to get to the bottom, figure out what happened before someone told me, you know, to go back to my apartment and, you know, let them get away with it. So I asked Pam McNair to come. Uh, you need another officer to front door to help out. You need another. Why would you fuck that, man? Fuck y'all police, nigga. Y'all can suck hard back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, police ass. Right, right. And you, the way you treat and I said he's and got traffic prostitutes, and do you go out of your me. way to tell that him nothing to that do I recorded him. Yes, because you have no business recording prostitutes. She has your conversations in your home up on YouTube with lies underneath it. Call saying that you um, hire prostitutes. All right, George, come on. You mean these neighbors that have been harassing me since 2006? They're saying you've been harassing them. So how is that? This, this, this is how I'm harassing them? This is why I want to do this inside. Now you're getting loud. I have no hey, support. Listen, you're you're dangerously close. I come home, I go in my home, I leave, I go to work, I do nothing. I used I to do that Shut up and let me talk, you I crazy whore. I have done nothing to you. Because they keep calling me 
calling us. They're the ones calling. Whatever's going on, they're the ones calling. Yet you get away from my car because I don't trust you, you crazy wow. thing. I'm going upstairs you... to download this. Go ahead. But you really, so you really think I'm going to hurt your car? Yes. Let me finish. Have I ever been violent? Have I ever been violent yes, towards you? Yes, you have. Really? When, yes, you when have. When was that? Yes, you have. When? So when you put this now, up. tell me when you've been. You have this it's part. on. Tell me when I've been violent. The person who is downloading this video lies. You made this happen. And I've recorded anything. them. What about hurting you? No, 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 no. I know. I didn't want to talk to her. The day you were going off over here about the laundry. Remember when I walked by and she said, did you tell him that you put the knife there? I said, let me go. I know. <laughs> let me go. Okay. You go to the management company or, or the police. That is what you do. Oh, he's a a director. Big difference. The ones that tell the management company what to do. Like to write the checks for the door that was broken twice last week by the prostitute. And we all know about it. So what's your point? And we all know about it. So what's your point? Or, or the police. Okay. And you know what? This guy buys prostitutes to the house every day? Is it affecting you? How does it affect you? Are the prostitutes, are they committing crimes against you? Probably not. I'm not saying the guy's innocent. I'm not saying he's not, you know, provoking you at times. What I'm saying is, it's going both ways. Okay? And one person's back in. So you're the person being overly stressed out, okay? So let it, let it go. Did you see Frozen? Let it go. Let it go. All right? I'm going. And speaking of letting it go, I'm going, okay? Call me November 30th and tell me how it works out. All right. That is what you do. That is the avenues provided to you okay. by your taxpayer dollars. Okay. Okay? Really? Mm -hmm. And I've recorded anything. them. About hurting you. Because I'm snap. I know. I know. I know. I know. That's what I do. I do She's a. She's psycho. Here's the deal. She's crazy. And she needs medication. I come home, I go in my home, I leave, I go to work, I do nothing. I used I to do that Shut too. up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do that too. I have done nothing to you. Somebody's gonna come out clapping, I'm gonna get this shit on camera. Uh, can you need another officer to front door to help out. Why would you fuck that, man? Fuck y'all police, nigga. Y'all can suck hard back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, police ass. Right, right. So what, man? Well, 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 well. There are doctors that will give you medication that will help you. Get what will they help me do, Robin? Not get beat up by the prostitute or have a hammer well, put in my head? I don't head? know anything about you getting beat up because I've never seen or heard anything of that. Are you doing laundry? It's too late. So am I in the way? Yeah. I guess I know what this conversation is about. You? There is nothing in these rooms, so what you're saying is true, because it's all crazy land. Okay. I don't need you to come closer, because I don't trust you. You're crazy. Really? So the cops just asked Paul if he's seen Glynis. And when your pictures prove something of reality, because they don't. Oh, okay. But well, you need well, help, honey. Well. Get help. Hey, Paul. Can you ask the prostitute when she'll be finished doing her laundry? 
just done a couple loads so far and left them in there for about an hour without uh, finishing it up. I don't know who it is. Robin's friendly with her. Maybe Robin could ask her. Can you ask the prostitute when she's finished doing her laundry? When she'll be finished doing her laundry, I mean? I just thought since you're such good friends with her, warning her about me recording her and everything. Sorry? I need help? You do. Because there's a and whore can, in the laundry room? And you can film me and you can put that on YouTube. There is a whore in the laundry room with a man that wants to put a hammer in my dog's head. Talking about killing my dog. And I record it. Because you use your friends. authority and responsibility to make these people feel at home and comfortable. Oh, really? Oh, really? That, what do you, why do you think I record everything? Why would you encourage him? You know he's violent. You've seen the prostitutes. You've seen my videos that are there to protect myself. You laugh. Bruce, I bet you couldn't find, I bet you, you couldn't find anybody worse than Bataille. Oh, no, I could. Well, go ahead, because you think <laughs> I want to be here? <laughs> you honest? If they move, I am going to put the worst person in the world there. You already have. I oh. No. I still have. No more of this. We don't want to hear any more complaints. I don't know anything about the hostages. Oh, oh. They got ripped off. The, the rock was smaller than they were expecting. Have a good night, Rena. Okay. Then why would you go in there? Then why would you go in there and tell him? I was talking to a neighbor. Telling him that I that I filmed prostitutes. No, I told him. Hoping, hoping that he would get angry, just like Pam and Dolores, beat down my door, have pimps show up. Have the prostitutes? No, you're, oh, really? Uh, who's the one that needs to listen? Let's see, because you're crazy. We all know, so let's just see. Once the cops hear it, they're like, oh, it's her again? <laughs> they're like, we've been, I, I we've been here four different times for four different people. I the reason why I called Tony, yes. I said she might call Tony. Yes, I called Tony. I called Tony. I got a real excuse. Oh, Tony. Oh, Tony. Oh, Tony. I can't ask you if I heard wrong. No. I can't? No. In the first my mom, uh, Lou Ray, um, that she's parked in a visitor's spot two, two more times, either in defiance, and these are the only two choices, either in defiance or because she thinks she can continue to do it. But the board has told me to tell her if she continues, she'll be fine again, da 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 da. Um, 
and uh, that's what I'm talking about. It, it's like it can't be that I left my car in the shade because I was trying to cool it off for for their deterioration. It's like it's either because I'm in defiance or that I just think I can continue to do it or you know whatever. So my question is, um, you know, what, if you were me, what would you do? In light of that letter, I'd park in your marked spot. Yeah, that's what I've been doing all along. My point is, I'm the one that's singled out and and uh, and have been in compliance. I'm totally doing what I'm supposed to do, but I just want to understand why I am um, the target. Because I mean, it's kind of obvious. You're not a target. The board told us to run a red letter. We run a letter. All right, all right, I'll try one more time. My dashboard's melting off, and you tell me not to say that because I sound like I whine. They don't want to hear things like that. So, um, but that's the reality. I have a practical reason for leaving my car in the shade for 15 minutes, and I can't do that without being fined monetarily. Not just harassed mentally, but fined. I think at this point, it should be pretty obvious that it's easier to just park in the numbered parking spot. Because you say you're being harassed mentally and all this stuff, just park in the parking spot. I'm sorry, once again, that's what I have been doing. So why am I continuing to get aggressive, um, vindictive, mean, um, singled out letters from VIP? So I just asked this guy if he could move to park somewhere else, and I think he's the one that made me have a flat tire this morning when he's between his cars washing it. So there's my flat tire, and now he just gets out and is practically threatening me, coming over to me, and um, that's how I live in this fucking hell of a hole. No, I told the cops that I said, I don't even speak to the troll. No, 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 I'll speak to her. Yeah, nobody does it. Uh, punch her on face, though. She brings it on herself, man. That's all. She brings it on herself. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. They turned on and off my electricity, so my computer got fried. She has your conversations in your home up on YouTube with lies underneath it. Call saying that you, um hire prostitutes, saying that you have something to do with the murder of your ex-girlfriend, hiding the car. Yeah, see, these are the lies. So she's right when I came downstairs, the super told me that he saw Connor trying to figure out what happened, and it looks like he tried to turn on his own electricity, and in doing so, fried someone else's apartment. The, the door is all mangled open and all That's I did was ask him if he was crazy. I didn't want to call the police on him or get him in trouble or anything. She's psycho. 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 She's she brings it on herself, man. That's all. She brought this on herself! You made this happen. We just couldn't honor everybody. So I asked Pam McNair to come. Uh, so why don't you come up, Pam, and bring your um, your relatives with you? Hey, let's make because we're gonna uh, bestow some honors on some uh, well-known citizens. You don't want me to sue you for your little Honda and your little condo. Don't mess with me. You mean you and your ten million dollar 
money? Uh-huh, that. Uh-huh, that. Yeah, that's what that you're going to do with it? I have a top eight lawyer that will chew you apart. Okay? Ugly. Wow. Okay? Ugly. Okay? Ugly. Wow. Okay, Wiggy. Yeah, but you used to. So how about I just talk about this online? Is that a good idea? No, because that's harassment. Oh, I can't talk about this online? No, you can't bash other people online. That bash? Is, that, is, that is called I'm harassment. sorry, if I discuss me being harassed and put through this, Not um, well, I time. know it's are legal. You, are you 14 years old? If you're being harassed, you contact the management company or the police. That's it. That's what adults do. That's why I called that's the police a couple do. of hours ago. And asked him what the advice was. And he told you what you were well, explaining. Well, no, he saying. told me to talk to Johansson tomorrow. Uh, because you're, this you're gonna, woman... You're going to talk me in circles, but am I making sense? Well, what are you going to run on the internet and post stuff? But what is that going to do? What is that going to do? Do you want to solve the problem or do you just want to stew in the drama? Like, what do you want to do here? They're going to find me... What do you want to do here? Thousands of dollars. Who's going to find you thousands of dollars? That's what I'm trying to tell you. That's what I was Who? told this thousands morning. Thousands of dollars about what? This park, guy, the, the guy spot. across the street, and the other board member really? told me that in email they have spoken about my I taking him to small that's, claims that court, is a civil complaint. and yeah. they yeah. are they are that. accruing that legal has fees. To do, that has nothing to do. That with will why. come. Will you be quiet and listen to me? That has nothing to do with why we're here. We're here about alleged harassment allegations made against you. Okay, this is the tangible evidence. You said you wrote these. These items. That's these, from my You don't write garbage. letters. First of all, first of all, I wasn't born yesterday. You don't write official letters to schools like a, like a crayon, purple crayon, or black Notes. Paper, okay? Notes to myself that were in my garbage uh, down yourself, here. Whatever. You said you were writing They go in my garbage, and you're here you're telling me that I am borderline you, criminal. You, listen. And you ask me why listen, I want to talk about it online? Listen to me. You told me you wrote these. This is tangible evidence of potential harassment. Okay. No I also you told you it, that no it's from my garbage, but they took it out of my garbage. No matter how you want to slice it. And you want to really, like, This is like, why I'm here, okay? This is why I'm here. You gave that right. back to me, and then okay. you took it back. Well, it's in you gave it to you. You gave it to me. Listen, all right. It was in my hand, and this you asked for it back. This is potential harassment, okay? You can dance around with me all you want. But what I'm telling you <laughs> is the beefs that you have are civil. I need to be pursued as such. And anything else you do... <laughs> You know, what's, you know, what's, what is it about me that your father wants to bully me? He doesn't. He gets told by the board what to say. So you didn't mention to him that, you know, she just might park in the shade for a little bit to cool off because her dashboard's melting. Why is that so unreasonable? I guess that's what my question is. Because it's against the rules. We sent you a copy of the rules that said single cars are to park in the numbered parking spots. And for months I've mentioned that all these other rules are broken and was wondering why I'm the one that just gets targeted and everyone else seems to just not worry about parking stickers or leaving their friends' cars in their spots indefinitely, you know, and, and uh, I'm the only one that gets singled out. Is there a reason that you're parked in my parking spot over the line? I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. Your car is parked in my spot, as if deliberately. In your spot? Over the line in my spot. Your spot's the next one over? With all the room that you have to the left, Let's see if it's over the line. If it's over the line... Well, you can take my word for it. It is line, over the line. Over. It's not about 
moving it. It's about why you did it. And of all the years that you find me for this and that and the other thing, as if you don't know. This tire is on the line. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, so you're so you're gonna say that this is okay that you've parked this way? Sure. Sure? Sure. What's wrong with it? Really? Oh, where are you gonna get Because off? you can't get through. My car was parked six inches. I had to move my car. You didn't have to move your car. You don't get in on this side. Oh, uh, look at Lou making everything better. Wake up. Fuck you. That's you. Oh, really? That's you. Oh, and the Department of Corrections, that's me too? What did I ever do to you to deserve to be talked to in such a vulgar, disgusting way? And the answer to that would be nothing. For three years, I have to live with your tenant threatening me violently with prostitutes on a daily basis. You bring me to the point where I have to film it to show you, to show the police so I can find out what, that it's a freaking Why didn't I call the police? Sure. If you felt there was a problem. Okay, so you're covering up for the police. I can't believe my camera went dead, but this captures a moment of how confidently he dares me to call the police, that he has successfully trashed me to the police, making me completely vulnerable to his crap. Why didn't I call the police? Sure. If you felt there was a problem... Okay, so you're covering up for the... No, 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 no. No, please don't leave. Are you kidding me? Thanks a lot. Are you like that? You like that? And he just leaves because he's your friend? You're so crazy. You st I'm crazy? You're because nuts. you parked over my fucking line oh, after three Regina. years of your abuse. And you're making this worse. You tell me the Department of Corrections is coming here I never to gang you. rape me? I, I recorded it, you anything. fuck! I recorded it! Well, then, that's illegal, isn't it? No, sweetheart, it's not. And you're going to be sued, you stupid old man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And they can stay and do what they want, just like if you want to... Yeah. Well, the, you know, the Department of Corrections will be in. Yeah, all right. They'll, uh, they'll get it cleaned up. Okay. And then they'll be able to use it. Okay. Thank you, Ray. Hello. Once the cops get here, they're like, oh, it's her again? <laughs> they're like, we've no, been, I, we've I been here four different times for four different people. You sleep with your dog. No. We'll see when the cops get here. Yeah. That's yeah. all you gotta say. I'll wait for them. Somebody's gonna come out clapping. I'm gonna get this shit on camera. Uh, can you need another officer to front door to help out. You need another. Why would you fuck that, man? Fuck y'all police, nigga. Y'all can suck hard back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, police ass. Right, right. So what? We just couldn't honor everybody. You're gonna go back to the psycho home. That's all you're gonna do. Psycho you've home? You've been there four times. Without my computer. You've been there four times. Really? Four times. I recorded you go right. on my property last night. I'm gonna get you locked up if I. I can and get you locked up. Get me locked up you're now, Mark. Me. I, listen, get me lo Please bear with me. I'm not a politician. <laughs> Call the police and tell them I threatened you. Wow, these niggas is not playing. You don't get this action detail. I'd be out. I'd be out. I'd be out. I'd be out. We just couldn't honor everybody. So I asked Pam McNair to come. Uh, so why don't you come up, Pam, and bring your um, your relatives with you? We just couldn't honor everybody. I used, I used to do that shut too. Shut up and let me talk, you I used crazy to do whore. That too. I have done nothing to you. Yet you get away from my car because I don't trust you, you wow. crazy thing. From when you. was I violent towards you? Tell me. I never wished you did. But you. you Where a sexual assault rape um, um, of two female minors uh, by five minors were reported, and uh, after a three month investigation, 
all six juveniles were arrested. Liaison reports, Joe? Uh, no, there was an arrest a few days ago, I believe, for a murder suspect that came out of Florida to court him in Peekskill. Oh, Marshal, the Marshals, right? Officer Greg Jones did a great job. He uh, notified the U.S. Marshal's office. Really? And he did an arrest within an hour. So. I heard, the, heard the U.S. Marshals were here like in 12 minutes. Yeah, they're here. So that we can Very rapid that, response, I guess so. we can make that public now. I thought we weren't supposed to have that. Uh, it's public. Still, they it's did public, their own yeah. press release. Yeah. Okay. Well, didn't even invite the mayor. To. <laughs> oh dear. My officers made my the my. arrest. He said, "I will kill her. I will kill her." I'm listening to you, and I want you to listen to me for one minute. I know, but the end of that was he said it would this, kill me. So that was the whole point. You, this is what you should do in your life. For what you should pick November first. When November first comes around, you should take your phone and leave it on the kitchen table and turn it off. That would be like you going to work without your gun. Listen to me. And for one month as an experiment, you should not make a single recording. You should not go on YouTube and post videos. You should do nothing for one month, for 30 days or 31 days, for one month. And when you go out, see your neighbors, you should ignore them. Don't talk to them, or if you talk to them, just say hello, nothing more. Don't complain about them. Don't do anything for one month. And see, see what happens in that one month. See what, see what would happen. Because you know what? I bet things would start getting better. We go out for the police. Yeah, that's what you fight for. Yes, I fight for the police. 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 Oh my God! How can they let them do this? Who was ever And I've recorded them. About hurting you. Because I was mad. I know. I know. I know. That's what I did. I know. She's a. She's psycho. Here's Ada. 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 The threat started on Tuesday night as black students gathered underneath the campus's clock tower for a peaceful rally to bring awareness to what they say is racism on college campuses. I think it's really important for us. Like, I can't understand that we are seriously under attack like never before. Check out Facebook, you know what I'm saying? First floor, first floor, my list. You know what I'm saying? You know, head, man. What's up? You know what I'm saying? AKA Pimp Juice, AKA Mr. International, man. Juice was like, what you're doing is like the first question. Oh, if I can pay you $500 to just to talk to I'm to myself. Uh, I told crazy. you. As so, long as she gets some I, I conversation. But you can run and threaten her when she talks to you because she can run and say some real cool exactly. Exactly. until she started calling me all kind of motherfuckers. Right. And that's when I go, bitch, I will not right. go right. 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 So we went into it one day when I she said, I came up, she said, can I ask you a question? I said, no. Right. 
right. She, she, just she, but she doesn't no. stop. Oh, she no, 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 she said to me, oh, yeah, and her job said, so you, you, you giggle and laughing and talk, da, 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 talk da, da, about me. Talk about, oh, I ain't had a fight since I was something. Why are you in my business? Right. How you know what I was talking to? Oh, See, okay. that's what I'm saying. It's oh, bad. It's and and she, said, and she said, and I swear, Lord, on my son, she said, and Glennis, she ain't not bad. I said, yeah. I said, go tell her that. Yeah. Try me. Everybody's on her. Go straight up. I said, I'm not the one. Right. I told her you're messing with the wrong one, boo. No, with your ass. Yes, yes. Oh, see, well, that's what I said. And that's what I told her. I said, you two, you can't. Bitch, I bust my head and walk over. And I told her. And then she took a picture. She took a picture. She said, this is the crap yeah. here, yo. I said, man, want to make this bitch? Because I saw her talking about one. And then she said, said extremely fake because I was trying so hard to get to the bottom, figure out what happened before someone told me, you know, to go back to my apartment and, you know, let them get away with it. So I asked Pam McNair to come. Uh, we need another officer to the front door to help out. We need another. Why would you fuck that, man? Fuck y'all police, nigga. Y'all can suck hard back dick, nigga. Fuck out of here, police ass. You know, what is it about me? that your father wants to bully me. He doesn't. He gets told by the board what to say. So you didn't mention to him that, you know, she just might park in the shade for a little bit to cool off because her dashboard's melting. Why is that so unreasonable? I guess that's what my question is. Because it's against the rules. We sent you a copy of the rules that said single cars are to park in the numbered parking spots. And for months I've mentioned that all these other rules are broken and was wondering why I'm the one that just gets targeted and everyone else seems to just not worry about parking stickers or leaving their friends' cars in their spots indefinitely, you know, and and uh, I'm the only one that gets singled out. And she smokes she has no fun in the thing. And she's a bit on it's all over Yeah. Me too? Oh everybody. And she got me up on it. Everybody. No, 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 no. She got me up on the internet. Everybody. Well, I would give a crap up. Uh, That's the like uh, everyone's on the internet. If she got me on the internet, I'm getting okay. me a bar and I will see it. Everyone's on YouTube. I wouldn't care. Right. Don't you go nowhere because she and everybody because of you. If we see, if she see me say, she oh, me on the, on the you, all of a sudden she's on a crazy because we talking about her and you are on YouTube. Can we, I asked the policeman, I you got to do it. Oh, she got to do it. She got to do it. She got to do it. She got to She got to do it. She got to She got to do it. She She got to do it. 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 She
I met with the district attorney. I've met with the chief of police. Wow. I have been there. I've met with lawyers. Yeah. There is nothing they can do. No, so so it's not illegal. 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 But they know it's going to be because of her. It's not illegal. What's she doing? But remember when Willowbrook was open? If I said you need it, they'd come and straight jack you and do a check survey on your ass. And if you... She's from sundown. Because I know it's something. And that's what maybe that's what's going on. No. No. Right. Right. We were making like this. She starts to go. No, 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 no. That's what it does to her. No, no. I'm telling you the truth. I'm not lying. She's from sun up to sundown. I know the person who's getting it from. Mommy, Tommy. She asked me to get it from a couple of times. I said, I got it set up. Yeah, that's what, that's what I was thinking to do. That's what I was thinking to do. I told her, I already taped it. I got some of it. I told her, I, I said, see what you're going to do. I'm not going back. I'm not going back. Don't throw it down there no more. Where are you going? Free Chuggington. 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 Hurry up, because i got to go and try to get some money. It's going to be a great day in Chuggington. Oh! Let's put this on. Why can't you wear your white beetle? Come here. Mommy going to get the truck. Mommy going to get the truck. Oh, he'll stay with me. You know, I don't let him play. I stop him from doing wild things. Yeah. Yeah, but you check him when he do it. Cheetah's even cold. She's going to go to that. Happy Cheetah. No. How could she not know that? She's definitely on the internet. Everybody's on it. And she took she picture on my car from her own. So I'm from her window. I said, this is the crack Let me do it. See, let me say something. I know you smoking. I know who's selling it to you. I've seen you smoking. And you're going to call a crack off all the time, right? Okay. All right. Watch this. You're in a glass house, bitch. Don't throw no shit. You're in a blast house right now. Dead. Yeah. Try to say something. What's up? What's up? What's up? I'm going to try to get some money. Where are you going? Come here. Come here. Don't go yet. Wait till mommy comes back. Wait till mommy comes back. She's going to make me right back. Let's go get an ice cream till mommy comes back. Oh, I said. When I get, where's my hug? Mm. 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 Yeah, no, no. It's yeah. not your fault. She just, she just 
Cuckoo. Yeah, she just she, she just yeah. hates you more than everybody else, Robin. So when yeah. when they yeah. see when yeah. when who she thinks she can be a friend with talking to you, all of a sudden. Guess what happened? I was I was friends with Robin, and then she 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 turned on me. Yeah. I'm the only person in the building still talking to her. Yeah. At that time. I was for a while. I mean, I, but, but I say hi to everybody. Speak, but you know what? You don't push me to the brink to it. You made me come out of my character, huh? You'll do it. Oh, man, it went off. So change and be all right with you, but she's going to get you again. That's why I don't speak to me, because I'm not going to live my life like that. But today, this week, we're all right. Next week, you want me to trip on you. Because I'll snap. I know. I know. I know. I know. That's what I do. I usually don't snap. No, see, y'all calling the police. No. She going to call them on me. Because I'm going to knock her down. Is that her? The reason why I call police, I said she might call police. Yes, I call the police. I call the All of a sudden, because all of a sudden I was going to be next. So I was going. Take her to the to the to the school. Take her to school. 